Hello everybody. Today we're going to be diving into a scandal that will forever hold a special place in my heart. This is a story of how one man tried to finesse women in their own month. It all started with Vanity's and Nurse Jassy's Woman of Power Top 16 Tournament, a tournament where the entry requirements were to be a woman or non-binary. Among the participants, there was a player known as Bloody Blossom, or so everyone thought. Using Bloody Blossom's account, her boyfriend entered the tournament in disguise. As the tournament got on the way, Bloody Blossom's boyfriend quickly rose through the rankings, defeating opponent after opponent. His skills seemed unmatched and suspicions began to arise. One of the players said, and I quote, Never seen a level 7 Kenshi with that level of skill. I'm just really disappointed that you would even do some shit like this. So it wasn't long before the truth came to light. These gamers started to notice that Kenshi was a bit odd. Bloody Blossom's gameplay style raised some concerns to the tournament organizers. For example, look at this tweet from one of the organizers. This boyfriend is someone I personally know and when someone sent me this whatsapp story I knew I had to tell someone this loser was playing under someone else's account. Soon after sharing my information and screenshot with players they started contacting some organizers of the tournament and then the news spread through Twitter. Screenshot and tweets emerged revealing his deceitful actions and the reactions of the shocked players. The participants were outraged and rightfully so, condemning him for his like sneaky tactics and disrespect towards this tournament. Realizing the severity of her actions, or both their actions, Bloody Blossom issued a public apology, which you can see right here, where she admitted to pretty much cheating and expressed some remorse. She acknowledged that she let him play because it made him happy, I guess, which is weird. It's safe to say that they're banned from this type of tournament. This isn't the first time and probably won't be the last time something like this happens. A very important detail I forgot to mention is that these were the standings at the end of the tournament. He didn't even win the tournament. He was smurfing, he was cheating, and he still didn't even win the tournament. It was confirmed by the host that only the top two made money. So he was flexing on money he didn't even make in conclusion just don't cheat don't do dumb things like this that for money or clout all right bye